Bam, bam, bam. Ten gallon tank. So we went out and got a ten gallon tank because the three gallon was too small for them. Um, I know some people are going to be like, even the ten gallon is too small. Well, you know what? I got some uh, choice words to say to you guys. I don't care. <laughs> I could be even more rude about it, but I'm not going to. There are two goldfish. We're not getting any more fish. When they go, I don't even know if we're going to get any more goldfish. We might switch then to um, the uh, tropical fish that can are supposed to be in a 10 gallon tank. Because we don't have a heater yet for the tank, but we are planning to get a heater. Even if these fish survive for a while, they'll have a heater for the summer. Because this room, I have to have air conditioned in the summer because it's way too hot. And I, and I don't want to freeze them in the summer, so they'll have a heater. Um, so we just got this tank at Walmart. It's 10 gallons. Mm -hmm. I like it. They look so small in it. Um, we took away the one plant, though, because it just, I don't know, it was overcrowding. I like this stone thing here. We got that one there, away from the filter. That's another reason why we got the tank, is the there's a filter, a proper filtration for them. Instead of changing, like, 30% of the water, like, every two days. It's a little annoying. There's that purple plant that's really nice. Uh, the gravel, we got another bag of black and one bag of red. So there's two bags of blacks and one bag of red. They were each uh, five pounds. So there's 15 pounds of gravel in here. Uh, then we used the air pump from the last little tank, but I bought an air stone. It's just a shell, but I had to bury it because it was floating. And that was like only $1.50 for the stone, which is kind of cool since we already had the pump. So we got some bubbles going on that corner in the filter thermometers over here and whenever we get the heater we'll also go in this corner because there's room on this hood for the electrical so they were doing good in the small tank really um the black fish his name is blackie because we're i'm so creative and the orange one his name is goldie so blackie and goldie the blackie didn't look good the first day we had him and then the next day he looked better we did like a 50 percent water change so I think that's what the problem was. And he's, he looks really good now, so hopefully he takes to this. We redid everything. We put the like safe start in the water to uh, get get going the uh, good bacteria balance and like water conditioner. Water conditioner is in there. Uh, aquarium salt is in there because they like that. It's good for their gills. It's good for disease. Or, so here's the 10-gallon tank. I'm surprised it fits here. This is my bed. This is like the headboard of my bed. <laughs> it's like the only place we could think of to put it. I just like looking at it. I like Blackie. It's goldy. I think they're gonna like it. They have a lot more room to swim around. They can really they didn't swim around much in the other one. There's no room. Especially with the bubbles being in the middle. Oh, it's trying to say hi. <laughs> okay, so that's probably the oh, where he's going. Probably will be the last video about the fish for a while because there's probably nothing more interesting to show of them unless something changes. Thanks for watching, please subscribe, and bye-bye.